Hello everybody. <clears throat> it's a nice Sunday. I'm about 11 miles north of <clears throat> Parker, Arizona. This is where you get into the rocky part. I'm going to go try to check out River Island State Park. Um, it's supposed to be up here around the corner. Ranger Station. Hello, I'm just doing a little exploring today. Sorry if I go check out, you got a beach here, right? For swimming? It, it's not hot enough today, but can I go drive? If you have one, absolutely. I, I'm getting a feel for the area. I'm trying to find the best damn place to kick it for a day and swim when it gets real hot. Okay. okay. Yeah. No, I no, I, it gets hot for me. I'm from the UP, Michigan. Any kind of hot is hot. I know. I know. Today, I just go look and see the nice places. Thank you, dear. Let me give you a look. Alright, this is the map. We're at the entrance. We're going to go check out the water. Got a boat ramp. She said they're swimming, so we'll go have a look. This whole area, all these parks, they're loaded with snowbirds from all over the country. The guy there on the left, he's got one, two, three, four, five, four different license plates. I guess he felt he had to have them. E each one of these, they've always let me just go in and drive around and look. But you know, I mean, if you're going to use their stuff, you, you pay the fee. It's no big deal. If you get a lot of a whole day of fun and swimming and stuff, you know, how can it not be worth it? And then plus they got showers, I guess. We'll check that out too. If the beach is real, real nice, you know, you come for the day, take a shower, get all cleaned up, and bam, done. She did look at me a little funny when I asked her about a beach. I guess nobody, I haven't seen one person swimming or in the water yet. There are swimming buoys. I suppose that they could go off on the side. Oh no, there's a swimming beach over here. It's nice and sandy. Got walkways to get to it, but yeah, there you go. It's like a little Gilligan's Island lagoon. Quite nice. I wish I could walk more. Yeah, look at the mountains, cliffs along the side. It's like they had to carve this baby right out of the mountains. We'll go check out the shower situation. Okay, they had a pretty good beach there. I talked to a gal for a few minutes. She got a pop top, not a high top. Said it was a pain in the butt for her to set up and take down. So she bought the wrong rig. Although I would like something a little bigger. I love the way I can drive this around. 
and see sights like this, I mean, it's incredible. And the nice thing about being here, I don't always have a white Nissan behind me honking the horn and uh, two little more little cars on each side and I just got to grab the steering wheel and you know what I'm talking about. You can drive at your leisure here. Looks like we're coming in to get another condo RV co-op. Okay. But yeah, this is your Parker Strip north of Parker. We got a couple state parks. A county park and a state park. They're pretty nice. It sure is a nice place to go in the winter. And you can get down to the water here. This would be perfect for boat or pontoon. Just pull out, pull out in the water and dive off. Put your ladder down so you can get back on the boat. Just park somewhere. Watch the boats go by, you know. There's a boat going right there on the left. Correct. You see him there? He's going about 40 miles an hour. top of the Parker Dam. On the right the water is not kind of deep and on the left there's nothing. A little river. <laughs> Harness the energy. This is kind of reminds me of the Hoover Dam. We're going to go over here and see if we can get some pictures and videos and take a break for today. This California side, when you go in California, they ask you, do you have any plants? What is it? Fruits or plants? And I say, no, I don't, actually. Oh, oh, oh yeah, we got to get where we can get a view. Back country byway. Doing the back country stuff. These big giant federal government setups they are great. Looks like we got a pullover place up right here. Looks like they put these barriers here so people don't try to drive across these big tandem truck trailers and blah blah blah. nice. Isn't it something? It looks like a great big giant swimming pool. And I think it's cool. Today's Sunday. It's not crowded. A little bit of clouds in the sky. The sun's not beating down. It's perfect. The only problem, none of my family's here with me. <clears throat> they see all these videos. They're going to They'll think real hard about doing their snowbirding stuff with me. So, okay, 
I'll get back with you if I see something cool. Okay, this is a little pull off from the highway that goes down by the water. It's like a little town, Parker Strip. But again, you know, they got lots and lots of places to eat. Well, that place is going on pretty good there. Must be a good spot. But yeah, it's a businessy district, so I figured I'd turn the camera on and you know what? You gotta get a feel for the area. And that's all I'm doing here. I am the messenger. I record it and I send it home. It's a very, very small town. It's actually probably just part of Parker, the North Park. You know, you drive a little ways and then these little towns, they pop up. I mean, they're, they're nice. They're nice all by themselves. Quads and boats are all set here. the sheriff trailing me. I don't know. Looks like pretty much all exclusive privately owned properties. Oh, the sheriff lit me up. He must have run my plate and found something he did not like. Alright, I'll leave the camera on for a minute. Why'd you light me up? <laughs> What's that? Why'd you light me up? That uh, stop back there at I, I pulled a little far up. I noticed far. that You're straight away. Full car length past the uh, stop sign. I noticed that afterwards, but with that all that construction and stuff, you know, I, I I'm the kind of guy that likes to get up there and look. That's and then no I, I when I look to the right and I seen you, I'm like, I pulled past that stop sign pretty far. <laughs> I, I figured that you know. I also figured maybe it was running my plate through lean and then, it, you know, there's nothing on there, so. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. I, I noticed that. I noticed All that. Right. Do you got your license on you? Yeah, it's, my wallet's on the floor here. I don't, right. I don't keep it on me. Any firearms in the vehicle? No. Any I, weapons of any kind? Knives? No, no, no. Nothing? Um, right. you want ID? Yeah. I'll pull it out here for you. I'm traveling. I come down from, uh, I'm snowboarding from the upper Michigan. All right. And I'm exploring around because I got two brothers and one sister that are, my brothers are retired. They don't like the up north winter as much as I don't. Yeah. So I'm, I make videos and I send them on YouTube. I'm trying not to brag too much. You know, they're stuck <laughs> in the damn snow there. It's snowing now too. Yeah. You know, they got it. 
But, you know, I'm trying to convince them that this is not a bad place to come for the winter. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like almost everybody around here, it seems. But, yeah, this is my first year out. And, uh, Where are you staying? Me? Well, I was staying out at um, Shea Road where they oh, had the yeah, van yeah. build. I got partied up with some of those YouTubers out there. Them just going crazy girls. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that was a little much for me. It was on my birthday, November 7th, oh, last okay. Thursday. That's the only reason I let myself go that far that night, but it was fun, you know what I mean? They're they're good people. Hell, they invited me over to their fire, and there ain't no firewood around here. No. So. No. But yeah, if you want to run my, my thing there. All um, right. Yeah, I'll be right back. Right. No, my, my license, it, you see it's expired, right? Yeah. But the trick is, is I renewed it through the mail. Let me see here. And... It, like, again, this is the first time I had to do these things, and here's the uh, the printout I got from the... No, for... Okay, just for, to... So you don't so say, you hey, man, why are you driving around with expired license? Yeah, no worries. Yep, yeah, right. All right, I'll be right back. Go ahead, yep.
checked all good? All good. Okay. All right, sir. Yeah, I know it's that stop sign. I'm trying to do the best I can out here. Right. Just, I don't know there. You know. Yeah, that's fine. So, and well, I will, uh, you enjoy yourself out here. Enjoy the winter. I'm trying to pull some family members down here. Yeah, I get hopefully. lonely, you know what I'm saying? So, But, you know, they're pretty... You know, they're a little town. They were born there. It's hard to get them to do anything. Yeah. I finally got retired out, so I'm like, I can either sit in the snowbank or I can go out to Arizona. There you go. Okay, thanks. Take care. I'll, I'll, I'll watch you. Stop saying Awesome. Stuff. Appreciate it. Okay, take care. Well, that went okay. Of course, I haven't been pulled over since I left. Well, I haven't been pulled over for many years. But it, I pulled past a stop sign too far. But he just ran me through lean. He didn't give me a ticket or nothing, so that's cool. But nonetheless, that kind of signals the that's enough for today type travel thingy. Besides, I'm getting low on gas. i got to get back to camp. Okay. 